I bought a $20,000 mystery box from one of the most iconic collectors in the world, the Pokemon Network. He dresses like Charizard, so he must be legit. The box is covered in fragile stickers, so I can only imagine what's inside. Okay, here we have it, the $20,000 mystery box, ready to open. I am, I literally have no idea what to expect out of this, so we're just gonna cut the sides, we're gonna open the box, and then we're gonna open up everything that we find inside of this. And again, I mean, $20,000, $20, there's a, High chance we get some crazy stuff. <laughs> All right, the opening of the box. Uh, just a, a guy jumps out and punches me in the face. <laughs> opening of the box, it's gonna be. I'm glad there's safety in here. <laughs> I'm glad it's packed as well, considering this is so expensive. Okay, well this is, oh my God, there's like, okay. First box we're on, on opening right now. What is this? We've got, we've got this. Okay, wait, ooh. Let's see what's inside here first. Here's box number one, and actually I realized that this is for another video I'll be doing here on the channel, so make sure to subscribe to see what's inside, because this will be insane. All right, next, oh my god, next box. Oh, this is, well this is it. This is the rest of it. I move this away. Okay, this is, I mean, this is massive. I, I like how this is packaged, this is good. All right, are you ready, Jake? All right, what's in there, is it, do you see, oh. <laughs> yeah, that's great. Okay. All right, again, shout out to the Pokemon Network, my homie, his Instagram's on screen. Check him out, absolute legend. He sold me a pack that we opened up and got a freaking uh, expedition base at Charizard. The moment was insane. Okay, cool, now we've got a bunch of boxes. Oh, we got a, wait, what is, okay, that's definitely a booster box. We got a couple of packages here. Are these just single cards? Any else? Now we've got all of these to open up. <laughs> Let's see what's inside of this. $20,000 mystery box. Oh my God. Okay, so this is the first box that I have here. It is so heavy. I mean, this is absolutely a booster box. Wait, do you see that? Wait, you could kind of see, oh my God. I think I know what this is. I'm gonna put it aside for now. Um, that is insane. <laughs> okay, let's open up this package right here. I, I have no idea if we're gonna get vintage cards or sealed packs or, or what, but again, $20,000 for a booster, for a mystery box. Oh God. So surely we're gonna see a lot of vintage. This is, oh, there's a ton of packs in here. Oh my God. Wow, cool. Okay, this is fun. Sweet, we got a bunch of different packs to choose from. Pick a pack, get it back, eh? All right, let's put this back here. Let's see, what is inside? Oh, these are booster packs. Okay, this could be, this could be some crazy stuff. Oh my God, it's the first edition Neo Genesis, bro. What? Oh my God. Dude, no way, bro. Oh wow, this is, I mean, this is the mystery box of mystery boxes, bro. First edition Neo Genesis, what a homie. Okay, if you're not following <laughs> the Procon Network uh, on Instagram, give him a follow, man. And if you're looking for any TCG stuff, bro, he is the hookup. This is, I mean, this is insane. Well, we're gonna, we're gonna open this. Let's open this. First edition Neo Genesis. Oh my, and it's a Lugia pack too, what a legend. I, should I be opening these? You know what, we're doing it. It's, it's, it's already open, and I asked myself if I should open them. All right, three cards to the front. I'm pretty sure this is, this is how this goes. We've got a first edition Reap, oh my God. Dude, this is so cool. I haven't opened up first edition Neo Genesis, and I can't tell you how long. Oh my God, Gir I might not have ever opened this before. Giraffe Rig, Moo Moo Milk, the Energy, Time Capsule, obviously the biggest Quilava, let's go, that's so big. The biggest cards to pull in Neo Genesis. You've got the Neo Genesis Holographic Lugia going for, I mean, tens of thousands of dollars at a PSA 10. Also the, I forget which one it is, there's two different Typhlosion to pull, but one of them is a really expensive one. I know for Alligator's big. I mean, Cyndaquil, we got Cyndaquil, we got Quilava. Is this the last card? Oh, this is the last card. Cynical Kalava, and out of first edition Neo Genesis, we've got an Oddish. Oh, wait, what? <laughs> wait, which one of these cards was the rare? Oh, it was the Time Capsule. Was it really? I, I think it was. I think it was the Time Capsule. I messed up the card trick. Well, either way. <laughs> we got Cyndaquil, which is beautiful. We got a Quilava. Oh my God. First Ed Neo Genesis. Okay, well, I mean, that was package number one. I mean, I don't know how this could get even crazier. Oh God. It's vintage, it's vintage, it's Japanese vintage. It's, oh my God, it's Japanese vintage Neo. Wait, wait, what's, what set is this? I actually don't know what, is this Expedition? Oh my God, wait, is this, J I think this is Japanese, <clears throat> Japanese Expedition base set and it's Japanese. Oh, there's, only, there's like only a couple cards in this pack. Wait, this is weird. I don't know if I've ever seen this before. Oh God, it's a long stem blister. Dude, this guy's a legend for sending us these. 
Okay. I don't know. Oh my god, I want to be sort of careful here. There's only a couple cards in. Huh. This is a curious thing. I've never ever opened this before. I don't know what the card trick is. There's five, only five cards inside this. This is vintage Japanese. I'm just going to flip it over and see what we get. Oh my god, wait, it's the hollow. We flipped it over to a hollow Pidgeot. Oh my god, that's so sick. Holographic. Dude, this card is amazing, bro. Look at the red on that. Okay, well, th there's a card trick for you. We did get a vintage hollow. We also got a, a Mareep. We've got an Oddish a Wurmple, and a Trainer Pokeball card. Oh my god. This is, we're two packs in, and this is the most insane mystery pack I've ever opened in my life. Wow, this is incredible, bro. Vintage Holographic Pidgeot. And again, I think this is Expedition Base Set. That is, that is sick. Okay, <laughs> dude, there's so many more of these packs, bro. This is, no, bro, no, I know what this is. It's Team Rocket First Edition, bro. <laughs> oh my god. God. Actually, funny enough, I did just recently get a first edition Team Rocket booster box that I will be opening up over on Whatnot. So I'm going to break that. My Whatnot link is in the description. If you're new to Whatnot, that'll give you 15 free dollars to bid. Let's open this pack, bro. Oh my God. First, it, geez, dude. The Charmander to start. Let's go. Oh, first edition Charmander. Okay. It's three to the front. I don't think I'm going to mess this card trick up. Neo's a little different. Listen, I think I know what's inside of that box right there. And if I'm correct, I'm going to be opening that box, which you'll see up tomorrow on a live stream on Whatnot. We're going to be box breaking a first edition fossil box. And what I think is inside of that, link for Whatnot in the description below. It is going to be an incredible break and an incredible stream. It'll be the first of many. A lot of vintage breaks there and a lot of uh, modern openings. So if you're looking for a place to find um, some legit slabs, uh, graded cards. God, look at that. Some legit vintage packs and modern packs. All over on Whatnot, link in the description. First edition Dottini, dude, no way. We've got a first edition Drowsy, a Goop Gas Attack, a Zubat, and I think this is the last one. It's... It's a, it's a hollow, bro! We got a vintage hollow! First edition Dark Arbok Holographic! Oh my god, bro, this is the craziest- we're three packs in? There's a whole nother thing to open up. First edition Dark Arbok Holographic- I- I need sleeves, dude. Got it. Got him. I mean, this is an insane opening. Okay, well, vintage hollows, vintage packs, first editions, what else do we have in here? It's fossil, baby. It's fossil! We've got a beautiful fossil unlimited pack, and again, speaking of fossil, I will be doing a First edition fossil box break over on Whatnot tomorrow, Friday, April, what is that, 6th? So link's in the description to join that. Okay, we're just gonna kind of destroy this pack. But this is an unlimited fossil pack. This is vintage, baby. Three to the front. Fossil has some beautiful Pokemon like Kingler and some insane cards, insane hollows to pull. Mount Fuji, Golduck, this is so cool. Just pack after pack of vintage. Shelder, we've got Krabby, the Recycle card, Gambler, Zubat, a horsey, and this might be the last one. It's a, oh my god, it's a holographic hypno. Dude, a fossil vintage hollow. Oh, another one, bro. That's two, ho three hollows so far. We'll absolutely be sleeving this up. My sleeves are all upside down. Oh my god. We are not even halfway through this box. Okay, we got two more packs here in these like mini mystery packs. This one is gonna be... What is that? Wait, this is, oh, so, oh, this is Neo Discovery. Dude, more Neo sets. I can't believe there's a first edition Neo Genesis pack in there. That is ridiculous. Neo Discovery, a sealed, sealed vintage Neo Discovery pack. Dude, oh, this is, I don't know if I'm ever gonna open up a more fun, cooler mystery box in my entire life. Granted, obviously we paid, I'm gonna go two to the front here because it's Neo. I don't exactly remember. Okay, unknown. Neo Discovery. Oh my god, it was not two to the front. No way, bro. A holographic Umbreon from Neo Discovery. That is a beautiful, this is the OG Moonbreon. Obviously from Evolving Skies, Moonbreon is like the, one of the most sought after cards in the entire set. Dude, this is the one that came first, bro. Moonbreon Hollow. Getting a closer look at that, that is an absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous card. A gorgeous Hollow. I will absolutely be grading that. Wow, what else is in this pack? We've got Hopip. Dun Sparse, Energy Arc, The Unknown, a Spinarak, Pineco, Mareep, and a Poliwhirl, and a Ruin Wall. But the big pull obviously being this holographic Neo Umbreon. Bro, are these are these heavy packs? Did he put heavy packs in this, dude? That'd be ridiculous. Last pack, and then we're gonna open up that box and see what's in there. The last pack inside of these little mini mystery pack bags. Oh boy, is this... It's Jungle! Oh my god, it's a Jungle pack. Okay, Jungle, fantastic. I also just recently got a first edition Jungle booster box, which I will also be breaking and opening over on whatnot. Again, man, I'm stocking up on the vintage. We're doing a lot of crazy stuff over there, a lot of breaks. Oh, and we'll make some really cool content with it too, so make sure you subscribe to this channel 
followed on whatnot. I can't believe we are opening this box, bro. This is nuts. Let's see what we got. Okay, vintage jungle pack. We've got a Sea King. A weepy dude, jungle. I love jungle because of the vibrance of the cards. Primate, an absolutely gorgeous set. Nidoran, Cubrone, look at this guy, just so elegant, amazing. Rhyhorn, Execute, the Oddish, a Goldeen, and the last card in the pack. Is this a heavy? Is this a hollow? It is a hollow, dude. It is a holographic pincer. Beautiful. Another vi dude. The amount. This is. This is the. This is. This is insane. This is insane. Holographic pin. Oh wait. This is the. This is the. The error. Hold on. As you can see, look. There's no. There's no. Uh. There's no jungle logo on this guy. This is an error. Wow. This might be worth actually like a, a, a load more because of that error. Hollow pincer out of the last pack. Oh my god. We still have so many more to open. Okay. Listen. I said I'd do it. We've got this box right here. I think I know what's inside of it. Let's rip this open. This is another one of the packages inside of the mystery box. It's. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Ah. It's magnetized. It is a sealed base set booster box. Oh my. god. God, bro. You ever just get a base set booster box inside of a mystery box? This is the craziest mystery box I will ever open in my life. A sealed base set unlimited booster box. As you can see, we got the Venusaur. Venusaur, you've got Charizard, the Blastoise. Wow, that is a, and it's so minty fresh. This is like a perfect booster box. I feel bad opening this thing up. It is so minty fresh. But I will be opening this up again, doing a base set unlimited booster box and a first edition fossil box break over on whatnot. Tomorrow, if you're watching this video the day it's uploaded, it is gonna be insane. So we're not opening this up, opening this up just yet. But what we will open up is the plastic off this next one. This is another booster box. Um, I, I assume it's booster box size. Oh boy. What is this? What is this? What did you put in here? It's a booster box. Oh, it's Fusion Strike. Okay, for sure. We got a little Fusion Strike booster box, fun. Okay, pause. I didn't know at the time, but apparently this Fusion Strike booster box is extremely special. As in, there's some crazy stuff inside. So I'll open it for a future video. Subscribe for that. Okay, and then as a part of the booster, as a part of the mystery box, the last bag that we have here is another bag of, I don't know what this is. This could be, this could be graded cards. This could be more vintage packs. Let's open this up. All right. Oh, God. It's more of these, bro. I like these. These are good times. Wait, but there's one, two, three. There's only four this time. Oh, they're, they're, they're way thicker. These are heavier. Okay, these might be graded slabs. And if they're anything like what we've opened and seen today, these might be some of the most insane things. Oh, God. Okay, let's do the first one. Is this a slab? Oh, it is a slab. Oh, my God. It's a slab. What? It what is that? Wait, Series 1? Oh my god. PSA Series 1, we're gonna reveal it in 3, 2, 1. It's- What is this? Oh, it's a 10! I don't- I don't even know what this is. I don't know the value of it. I've never seen this before. It is a 1999 Pokemon Action Flips Blastoise Series 1 3D chase card in a PSA 10. That is- I mean, that is so cool, and this is- I- I- I've never seen this in my life before. I wouldn't even know where to get this, bro. This is so sick. If you want a shot at getting one of these things, whatnot, link in the description. I This is, that is so cool. Okay, I'm gonna move the Fusion Strike box out of the way. All right, we're gonna put the Blastoise. That's so sick. In the back there, let's see what's in the next slab bag. Okay, let me make sure. Nice, he packaged it, I mean, literally perfectly so that I could reveal this on a YouTube video. And again, big shout out to the Pokemon Network. His Instagram is on screen and is linked in the description. Definitely check him out. Definitely give him what's up. The dude's an absolute legend, as you can see from the freaking mystery box he gave us. And we've got, it's a, sh oh my God, bro. A PSA 10 Shining Raichu from Neo Destiny. Neo Destiny is my favorite set ever. This is an absolutely iconic one. And it's a PSA 10? Dude, this is insane. 2002 Shining Raichu <laughs> PSA 10. Bro, I'm losing my mind right now. This is nuts. Shining Raichu. PSA 10 Shining Raichu. What? It's gonna be hard not to keep that in my personal collection. We're gonna put that guy back there. Two more bags to open up. Two more slabs to see inside of the $20,000 mystery box. Uh oh, this is Beckett. This is Beckett. Okay, you can see the grades on the back. 858598. So whatever this is, is probably like super vintage. All right, let's reveal the card in three, two, one. It's... A, oh my God, no freaking way, bro. That is wild, what? I mean, I don't, I think I'm gonna keep this, bro. I might keep this. <laughs> I said I was probably gonna give this away. 
I think I'm gonna keep this, man. This is easily the coolest card that has ever entered my office, that I've ever touched, that has ever entered my personal collection. This is a Near Mint 8.5 base set holographic Charizard with a Mitsuhiro Arita signature. It is a Be Beckett 10 autograph. This is a Beckett Pristine 10 Mitsuhiro Arita autograph. Oh my God. Mitsuhiro Arita, by the way, I'm a massive fan of. I've been trying to buy his art, his actual his art for a long time that's like not Pokemon. So to have this in the collection is, I mean, just simply ridiculous. Base set Hollow Charizard. And this is a near mint 8.5. So this is still a really, really nicely graded Hollow Charizard, a Becca Charizard. But to be signed by Mitsuhiro Arita, who did the original artwork for the Pokemon uh, TCG set, including made the, he made this design, creator of the original Charizard design. He signed this card and it came out to a 10. That is so cool. I should have known something was up with that because the slab is so much thicker. Okay, well, I'm not quite sure how to top that, but we've got one more slab. What is, what is this? Oh, is this CGC? Oh, we've got a CGC slab in here. This is cool. It's got like rubber around it. Okay, I like this. We got a little bit of PSA. We got some BGS. And now for the final slab, we've got CGC. And remember, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. We've got so many more of these amazing unboxings and videos coming to this channel. Make sure to give the Pokemon Network a follow on Instagram. His link's in the description. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the last slab of the night. It's a no way, bro. That is ridiculous. A pristine, a perfect pristine 10 Gold Star Suicune from EX Unseen Forces. Gold Star Shiny Suicune Hollow Pristine 10. Pristine 10 is technically a higher grade than a PSA 10. It is a really hard grade to get, nearly impossible to get. And to get that on a vintage card, a Gold Star? A Gold Star Suicune? That is insane. I don't even know the value on this card. That That is ridiculous. Dude, I mean, that plus the, I can't believe we got a Mitsuhiro Arita. <laughs> Mitsuhiro Rita Holographic Charizard. That's so sick. And a Shining Raichu PSA 10. And this 1999 PSA 10 uh, uh, Blastoise Hollow card. This is, I mean, just the coolest mystery box I have ever opened. I mean, and obviously not to mention a literal entire sealed base set booster box, bro. That is awesome. This was the craziest opening of my entire life. If you enjoyed, leave a like, subscribe, check out the Pokemon Network on Instagram. Thank you for watching. Check out the other videos on screen. I'll see you all in the next one. Oh my God.